hoping this umpteenth revision is the charm. Because every time we put Lisa's contract in front of Natalia, she picks up her nasty little pen and she has to cross everything out, doesn't she? No, 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 no that's not what I said. That's it. That's exactly. You're right. That's what she does. She says, oh, that's not what I want. That's not good enough. Well, when we give her exactly what she does want, then she finds something else new that she doesn't like. <sighs> All these attempts and quibbles and concessions, and we are absolutely bending over backwards for that woman. And still no final contract. Right. You know what I think, though? I think you kind of like that, because you... Are loving all these durable hours. Lucy, working with you is enough for me. Mm, with me? Don't you mean for? Well, kind of a collaboration. See, that's the way I see it. This is a big collaboration, right? Oh, I see. So I'm a great big collaborator, right? Yeah. Nice. So that means you aren't going to charge me. Yeah, I, I wouldn't go that far. Okay, you want me to help Danny? I'm guessing this has something to do with Jason. Uh, yes, I, I, I do, and Jason poses a physical danger to Dan. Sam, come on. I'm just afraid. What, that Jason's some kind of a bad influence? No, I wasn't going to say it like that. I mean, but yeah. Jason would never let anything... Can, can you just hear me out for a second, please? When Jason came back after he was shot, you remember that? I do, I, vividly, yes. Okay, well, he was held up at the Q's boathouse, and Danny accidentally found him there, and Jason got him to help him. Yet yeah, Danny is Jason's son, and, and Jason had a bullet wound. Exactly. What son should be helping their father with a gunshot wound? And to make matters worse, Jason had asked Danny to promise him not to tell me. Now, if you were in my place and Jason did that to one of your kids, how would that make you feel? If there were anyone else, I'd be furious. But I trust Jason. I do, Sam. He's always thinking ahead. Jason always has a reason. I might not like it, but I have to trust it. Jason would never let any harm come to our kids. His line of work that's always gonna happen it's his line of work it's his lifestyle what do you mean his lifestyle he, he follows danger he can't stay away from it he doesn't even try okay let's chase it is the last person that can guarantee danny's safety he would take a bullet for any of us sam he has i know that sounds heroic to you carly but have you ever asked yourself why any of us would be in the line of fire in the first place? Yes. That's a figure of speech, all right? Not where Jason is concerned. Look, I, I get it. Your loyalty to Jason comes first, last, and always. But I am asking you as a friend. Are we? Friends? Because we've been going back and forth a lot lately. Can you just accept that I feel differently about this than you do? And my concerns are real? And help me? I got a warning for Anna's personal email account. I found emails with Jack Brennan dating back five years. And now that you have this proof, you can shut pipe me down. Absolutely. Well, soon. Then you don't need me anymore. If you'd wanted to re-invite me to dinner, you could have just called. I could have, yeah. Or emailed or text. Next time I'll send a singing telegram. Oh, good. Who doesn't love a singing telegram? The problem with those methods of communication, they're from a distance. I'd like to be next to you. In the same room, in the same space. Have you ever noticed? Yes. Have I noticed? Yes. So that's a yes to dinner. Oh, I don't know. 